Welcome to another dynamic day of the 16 day fitness challenge. Today we are going to focus on all the joints of our body. We have 206 bones in the human body, but close to 360 joints. Did you know that? And if these joints are healthier, then all our movements are so much better. Let's go into that. Okay, so let's just shake a little bit to begin with. Warm up all the muscles, tendons, ligaments. If you're doing the exercises in the morning, you may notice that there is a little more stiffness, but the mind is more aware and present. In the evening, if you're doing it, then well, the body is more flexible and supple, but the mind may be all over the place because so many things have happened during the day. And you haven't reset with the sleep or with meditation. And relax. Now, let's start with one one joint at a time. So starting with the fingers, move your fingers, rotate your wrists, do it both ways and then add on the elbows, move the elbows, then the shoulders, the neck, the hips and the knees, ankles, toes. with deep joyful breaths. See how many joints you can move simultaneously. <laughs> Ankita seems to be much more at ease with this and more graceful. <laughs> Lalit is like the bodybuilder. <laughs> Come on, have some fun with it. It's a crazy joints play movement. Don't miss out on the hips or the shoulders, the neck. It's the mind body connection along with the breath. A little faster. Crazy is the mantra for today. Move, 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 move. And relax. Few deep breaths. Now let's look at each of the joints separately. Okay? You can squeeze your palms while moving them at the wrists both ways
from skull bone up to the shoulders squeeze your shoulders as well this will feel very good we involuntarily tend to do this when we take a lot of stress because this region holds a lot of stress so you squeeze it make the prana move there with deep breaths it's so good especially when someone else does it to us <sighs> fantastic now palms and the hips and we do some sideways and relax let's go on to the knees now very important part of our body because they hold they they support the weight of the body as well so what we do is we bring the thigh parallel to the floor and then we kick put the hand here around the knee joint feel all the muscles tendons ligaments just tighten this part with the breath ten breaths and then go on to the other knee feel all the structures here around the knee region and shake do a little shimmy okay now in this position you place both your hands on the knees bend them forward slightly and then straighten them bend them and straighten them internally tightening the knee joint and all the muscles tendons and ligaments around there now go right and straighten go anti clockwise straighten clockwise straighten anti clockwise straighten round and straight round and straight now both the knees go outside and straighten they come inwards straighten Very good. You'll start feeling a lot of things around the knee joint. Now, let's go on to the ankle. We'll rotate the ankle. First one way. And then the other. 
So there are 26 bones in the feet and 33 joints. Can you imagine how complex it is? And you squeeze the toes, straighten them. You'll not be able to see in my shoes. And kick and let go. The other foot. Rotate the ankle. Both ways. The toes, squeeze them as if you're holding on something and then bring them up. And kick with the legs. <sighs> Do you see? A sense of, just feel a sense of opening up more space created in the joints as well as the whole body. Yeah. Once again, shake the whole body. And now let's go down onto the mat. So first, let's put the feet together as close as we can. The heels to the groin. We hold the feet or your shoes, we swing on the sides. Shoes will make some funny sounds. If you're feeling more adventurous, you can just go down. <laughs> and on the other side. <laughs> Have some fun with yourself, but make sure that you are padded well below. And then in the center, you can flap your wings like a butterfly. This really opens up the pelvic joint. Good. Let's straighten our legs and bounce the knees, shake the hands. While you're doing this, you know, another exercise for the elbows is just touch the fingers to the shoulders and then straighten them by squeezing the elbow joint. Just as we did with the knee. Keep shaking your legs. Squeeze all the muscles, tendons, ligaments around the elbow joint. And you can pull your each finger. Decompression of the joints will happen at the phalanges. Keep moving, keep the back straight. shake off the fingers nice and hard you may feel the fingers will fall doesn't matter At the end of the session just pick them up and just keep the hands there you'll feel a buzz in the hands yeah? this is the subtle life force energy the prana you feel it around and inside okay now let's sit keep the spine erect and let's intertwine the fingers with the palms down turn the palms around and stretch lengthen the spine decompression of the spinal cord the vertebral column stretch stretch sit as tall as you can right from the tailbone up to the fingers and let go nice and slow arms come down very good now let's lie down on the stomach we straighten our hands out on the sides at the shoulder level and then we take the right leg bend it at the knee the foot goes on the other side and turn You'll notice things happening in the spine, in the shoulder, 
and come back to center now the other leg bend it at the knee the foot goes on the other side the head may rise up a little bit the shoulder is stretched the spine is getting twisted strengthen and come back to center and let's do this with each breath truly relaxes the entire spine all the joints there one more time and back to center feel the difference and slowly let us roll on to our back do the ardha pavan muktasan where you bend the leg at the knee bring it close to the chest and then rotate at the hips your head may come up or it may be resting on the floor either way is it's fine feel the movement deep inside the hip joint the hip socket and move it both ways and the other leg the other way let the body move with the rhythm of the breath and let go now place your feet on the floor knees are up feet close to your glutes little gap between the feet and now we touch the right knee to the left toe and then the left knee to the right toe arms are by the sides shoulder level whichever knee bends down you can turn your head to the opposite direction and come back to the center straighten your legs out we'll do the dancing shiva pose raise the right leg bend it at the knee take it on the other side and head turn to the right with your hand you can pull the knee down close it to the floor make sure the elbows continue touching the floor go on to the other side with the hand pull the knee closer to the floor and the shoulder continues touching the floor any twist will strengthen the muscles tremendously like a rope is nothing but twisted fibers and move your knees bounce your knees and shake your whole body the neck back of the neck let it touch the floor see if you can touch the lower back to the floor shake 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 and relax feel the entire body quieting down becoming stiller the breath is relaxing the whole body is softening dissolving merging into the infinite space around the gentle smile become aware of the whole body 
become aware of the whole body. Feel the entire body softening, dissolving, relaxing. And slowly bring a little movement in the body, moving your fingers, wriggling your toes, stretching your arms and legs. And let us slowly sit up, moving on to one side. Keeping the eyes closed. Let us chant Om three times and feel the sound vibrations in the entire body. Beautiful smile, you may slowly open your eyes. We've been talking about a healthy state of body through exercise and through good nutrition, food. Today, Gurudev is going to talk about the qualities of a healthy state of mind. Let's hear that from him. Enjoy your meditation and continue smiling throughout the day. I'll see you tomorrow. What are simple parameters by which one can get an idea of their state of health? A smile on their face and a confidence in them that they can do anything or address any challenge. I would consider that to be a healthy state of mind. And the good, real good health is your ability to take criticism. What happens when someone gives you compliment, you are all smiles. But one criticism from somewhere just can throw you off your balance. That is not a sign of good health. Huh? Ability to take criticism and courage to give criticism. Other aspect of uh, a robust, healthy person is that fearlessness, no hesitation, no fear. At the same time, humility. You know, people who consider themselves to be macho and have no fear, they have no humbleness, no humility. If you lack friendliness and humility, there is something seriously wrong with you. If you don't have tolerance, if you can't tolerate the differences, you cannot accommodate people with different state of mind or ideology, then also you, you are not healthy. That's what I would say. Let's sit back with a smile, relax and enjoy the meditation with Gurudev Shri Shri Ravi Shankar. Okay, let us sit for meditation. First of all, let us shake our hands a little bit. Comfortably, easily, shake our hands. And uh, stop shaking your hands and place them comfortably on your lap or on your knees. 
Now let us fix our gaze uh, one feet, one and a half feet in front of you. There you fix your gaze on the floor. And now let, let us keep our body still for three minutes. Our body is to be kept still like a statue. We can do it. We can keep our body still for three minutes only and also keep our gaze fixed at a point in front of us. Now, let's take a deep breath in and breathe out and as you breathe out, you may relax your shoulders. Let us become aware of our whole body. A body has billions and trillions of atoms. There is enormous energy in our body. Now we may gently close your eyes and let us take our attention to the back of our head. Though our eyes are closed, our mind or our attention still is in front. Let us notice it. Now gently take your mind or your attention to the back of your head. Let us become aware of our whole body. Our body is still. Let's take our attention. Scan our whole body from our own mind. Let's take our attention from the top of the head. Let us take our attention through the brain, back of the head. And notice that if there is any tension in the body, just let it be there. We are not in a hurry to get rid of any tension. We just want to keep everything as it is. Let's take our attention to our cheeks, our jaws, let's keep a big smile on our face as we smile all the muscles in our face and the brain gets relaxed. Keeping the smile on your face, take your attention to your throat and neck region. Our attention can flow down slowly, gradually, like a viscous fluid. Dheere dheere apne man ko niche leke aaye gale ke paas aur chhati mein phir ek gehri saans lijiye saans bhar dijiye aur dheere dheere chhode and let us take our attention to our chest our shoulders and arms Become aware of the circulation that is happening in your body. Now is the time for us to look into our own body. All the systems are functioning involuntarily. Relax your thighs, your knees. And any discomfort anywhere in the body, 
let us bear with it for just few minutes. Let it be there. Let us honor our own body. This body is a precious gift to us from God, from nature. Ishwar ka den hai hamara apna sharir ko man hi man hum aadar karte hai. It's the breath that is keeping us alive. Let's move to the second dimension, the breath. Incoming breath energizes the body, while outgoing breath brings relaxation to our body. This is the natural phenomenon which is happening all the time. Notice every time you breathe out, the whole body is relaxing. And when you breathe in, you are getting energized. Under sans lete vakt ko shakti milti hai, aur sans chhodte vakt sharir ko vishram mil rahi. Like fish in the water, we are in air. Our life is in the air all around us and inside of us. Jaisi jal mein machli, vaisi hawa mein hum hai. Humare beeta, bahar, vayu mandal hai. Iske prati sajak ho jaya. Simultaneously become aware of the air inside of you and the air all around you. Let's move into the third dimension, the mind. Our body is like the wick of a candle. The mind is like the glow around it. Shareer baati hai, to man jyoti hai. Jo bhi vichar aarehe ho man mein, is vat aane de. ना रोकना ना किसी विचार को टोकना है अच्छे बुरे कोई भी विचार पुराने नए आ रहे हो तो आने दें हम सिर्फ विश्राम करते जाएंगे जागृत विश्राम Restful alertness is what we are having right this moment. Let go of all your effort and simply relax. A wakeful rest. Our mind is subtler than air and subtler than water and air. And it radiates, spreads all around you. Man bahut patla hai aur fail jata hai charon dishaon. करने दीजिए, फैलने दे उनको। द 
Now let us become aware of the walls of the room we are sitting in. जिस कमरे में बैठे हैं वहाँ के दीवारों को याद कर लीजिए खिड़की या दीवार जस्ट बिकम अवेयर ऑफ द स्पेस इन द रूम यू आर इन as the mind expands and or you become aware of the space in the entire room your body starts relaxing more and more whatever is happening right this moment just let it be is waqt kuch tanav ho kahin koi asuvidha ho rehne de un sab asuvidhaon ko swikar karte hue vishram kare सब प्रयत्न छोड़ दे लेट गो ऑफ ऑल योर एफर्ट नॉट टू इंटेंटली लिजन टू द इंस्ट्रक्शन एज वेल जस्ट रिलैक्स दैट ऑल्सो this moment is nothing to do and nothing to know either is waqt na kuch karne ko hai na hi janne ko keval vishram karna hai as the body relaxes the mind expands and vice versa every night when we sleep the mind expands but we are not aware this moment let us relax and let the mind touch the ceiling sir ke choti par dhyan le jaye aur sir ke upar chhat tak ki duri ko smaran kare become aware of the space above you ahead up to the ceiling of the hall you are in And now let go of all your efforts. Abhi sab prayat chhod de. Kuch bhi nahi karna hai. Vishram aur gehri vishram. a body is still now a breath has become feeble and subtle a mind is calming down
whatever is happening, just let it happen. Whatever thoughts are coming, let them come. Kuch bhi na kare, na hi kuch janna hai, keval vishram. विशाल गगन है अरबों करबों तारे सितारे वास्ट स्काई मिलियंस ऑफ स्टार्स दे लेट गो ऑल योर एफर कोई कहीं भी तनाव रहे रहने दे उनको वैसे ही रहने दे अपने आप मिट जाएंगे सब ओम शांति 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 Om Shanti 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 मुस्कुराते मुस्कुराते सांस लीजिए और वो मुस्कान शरीर के कण कण तक पहुंचने दें लेट द स्माइल स्प्रेड टू एवरी सेल ऑफ अ बॉडी लेट एवरी सेल रिलैक्स 